Welcome back. Unfortunately, I don't have good news. My name is Gabriel, by the way. I think it's good to introduce yourself at the beginning of the material, even if you're watching the, la the latter. If you're watching the uh, previous episodes. <sighs> I'm missing something, I know that much. And I think it has to be somewhere here. I don't know, maybe something isn't highlighting again. Because this is uh, somehow intriguing. Teddy, he won't help us. Must be something here I'm missing. Because at the moment, these guys aren't helping. to get somehow the jewels uh, on one hand and maybe there should be something helping us to deal with uh, let's see no I need this somehow a small copper deposit if I had a pickaxe I could dig it out Hold up. There must be something here I hate when I'm stuck in those games, when I can't proceed. It's annoying. Go down. It's not helping us. Leave the shrine. No way we can get anything from here. This guy just gets annoyed. Sorry, so but there's someone on guard. <sighs> you know what? Screw it. I already once used the uh, guide. I don't like doing so, but it seems you'll have to. Okay, one thing I know. Found out what we should do. On this gap, we have to use those... this. Good. I'll lay the boards over the opening of the crevice. So we'll the probably... The won't support much weight. One course. step on them and they'll give way. And this guy will go down. After we use this little pom-pom on the string on him. This will allow us to get the shield, finally. Okay then, let's try it. This time it will work. I'm quite positive about that. Usually you can eliminate the stupid guy. Yeah, colorful, fluffy bunny. Do stop it, Blood. Something's wrong here. Just got to break shell. And ah! here we go. Sorry, guys, it wasn't intended. A fluffy bunny, I presume. How can anyone be so stupid? Uh huh. Hungry. Might Go into the corner and be ashamed of yourself. I'll come up with something. Sooner or later. <laughs> By the way, how we can go to the to corner? The way is clear. Finally. What's this? The pair are trapped down in the crevice. Yeah. Ah, finally, I have the shield. Thank you very much for getting me out of there. Aha. It's no fun swimming around in hot gravy all day. Then again, it's also no fun being constantly hit by swords and axes. <laughs> I hope you're not a warrior. Well... Hey. Nah, I just want to look like one. If you only want to look like one, then that's fine. <laughs> just don't fight. The pen is uh. mightier than the sword and hurts less. Yes. We have the shield. And it seems we'll have Still a very... Still an especially brave shield, eh? <laughs> I don't believe it! Marks! <laughs> ah. Who would have thought that we'd all be together again? Big Are you reunite to it? You're reuniting. Oh yeah, terrific. Listen, it's one yeah. thing that you kidnapped me, but does this dumbass have to come along? Yes. Still the same old you, eh? <laughs> Can the sword talk as well? Vladdy? Of course! Are we gonna get him, too? Yes! 
Oh, no way. <laughs> what a great pair. Over the last few years. I'm getting a really bad feeling about this whole thing. I do too. <sighs> It'll be a singing sword. It has to be a singing sword. Plus it's a talking sword. And the game and the RPG needs a talking sword. It's just something like, you know, it's on a, on, on a list. Good RPG goes with a dragon, uh, elf, gnome or something like that. And there is on the list a talking sword. Ah. The only thing left is we need to do something with this little gnome down there. See, or maybe we can get anything here working. No. Anything here. Do anything here. I need this dragon opening something. Maybe you have a anything that you can help me. Hello. Yes. Mm. About this, you you were going to get me the first gold coin. Ah, uh, yes, yes, okay. This is not moving us forward. Mm. Let's see, is there anything else there that we might use? I think so. In this dump, nothing highlights. No, nope. can't be here. I'd better keep myself a good ways away <laughs> from them. I don't want to get zapped by any of Zloth's lightning. Yeah. Damn it. There's still a one thing here, one thing here. No. It has to be somewhere in this mine. And it has to have... It has to deal with the shaft here. That was the name of this thing in the... There. What the hell can I... None of this can help us. A small... How can I deal with that? Give me a moment, because... I want to move this forward. We are stuck in this chapter long enough. Okay, okay, I know what we have to do now. Finally. I wouldn't have thought about that. This is a... You remember this uh, stone I put on the anvil? Nate will comment. An old anvil with dwarven lettering. Um. Yes, I know. And we smash it. There are crystals inside the stone, all sparkling and glinting. Yes. Now we have something. There are crystals inside the stone. Yes. Something we can give to this little bastard. If there was metal in the mold, I could... Yes. Move it. Ah. Can we speed up this? Yes, we can. As you can see, speeding up uh, during the editing of the video is quite good. You there, small guy. Take this. Look, see what I've got for you? Wooza! <laughs> oh, of course. And away. Now we can take this. Can I? Yes. And so, I think you now belong to me. A stone dragon's head, covered in soot. There's a square-shaped opening in mm -hmm. the back of its neck. That's the place where the lava will go, and we can take some offerings. The big stones stand out, but maybe I can take a few of the small gold nuggets unnoticed. Yes! Now we will be, ab we'll Seth, be able to- get him! The human has stolen some gold! So they can't hear you anymore? Huh? <laughs> So when you're sitting on top of my head, only I can hear you, right? <laughs> wow, what a bummer. Actually, this is not Don't good. Don't celebrate too much. I'm planning an opera for this evening. Wagner's Ring. <laughs> Great. <sighs> Time to get ourselves the sword. A few small polished gold nuggets. 
We put those in here in the press. The nuggets are too hard to just press them flat. I need to mm -hmm. smelt them or at least heat them up really well. So of course we have to use this. The head goes here. That's ah, done. Ha! The head fits perfectly. Now we what? A few small. Now we use this hatch. So we have to add lava. Lava flow. Yes, it does. This thing is now cold. Now we put uh, put this here. Pillory goes where? Takes this. No. So maybe we should just add it like that. Whew. Even with the pliers, the heat's almost unbearable. It's always unbearable. The furnace is so hot you can hardly get near it. Yes, you have to use this. The nuggets have melted in the furnace. A small golden pool is formed in the bowl. That's what we need, of course. The nuggets have melted in the furnace. A now we use this on the press. That will, of course, make the coin. Ah, good. I'll pour the gold into the mold. Should be just enough. Yes. Now we press it, make a coin. A superb gold coin with a vicious looking dwarf on it. It's still hot. Hmm, looks good. A wonderful homemade gold coin. Yeah. Handicrafts. Now let's speak with the dragon, give her the coin. Hello, gorgeous. And finally get ourselves the sword we need. Look, I've got the first coin for your treasure. May there be many more to follow. Of course. Oh, thank you. Here so, you have what it? about the sword? Well, yes. I'm lying on it. Could you take it? Hmm. Nice. And now the big reunion reunion of the whole. Where is it exactly? Oh. A bit further down, I think. Yes! There it is. That's the head off a pickaxe. Oh, come on. Uh, uh, just a bit further. Well, we have a pickaxe, that's good. Oh, great. Where's my sword? Ah, oh, it's, it's broken. broken. What? You're too heavy. It snapped under your weight. So that's why it suddenly stopped talking. <laughs> and it was so nice. It said that I was a terrible monster and that it would love to cut my head off. Hmm. That's no good to me. What am I going to do with a broken sword? I have to make it. You you could perhaps repair it? <sighs> to do that, do I, I like need a blacksmith? a blacksmith. Yes. You could learn. There's a book on smithying there. <laughs> Great. Another big Zero quest. Zero to weaponsmith in 14 days. 14 days? I don't have that much That's time. That's too long. I don't have 14 days. As, as then you'll have to read faster. Obvious. You'll find everything you need here. An anvil, fire, instructions. <sighs> Great. Huh. But to I do that, going. Happy practicing. we need course, probably some new form. What's this? This is a pickaxe. Put it on this, of course. Fits so we perfectly. have a pickaxe. We go to the mine because, of course, we need this pickaxe. Oh, too many walking here. Fortunately, I'm sitting on my comfortable chair. With the pickaxe, we'll be able to get ourselves this whatever that is on the on the wall here. And they'll probably will say "wooza" like everyone here in this mine. The dragon sword. has broken the sword. Could be difficult to mend a magic <laughs> sword, but I'm not going to get into the orc's camp without it. That is why we go with this. Use the copper. Uh, use the pickaxe on the copper. I've got three pieces of copper-bearing ore. Hmm, but no arcanite crystal in it. <laughs> now come on, do I need the crystal now? Nice. 
Tell magic me. sword, magic sword, magic. Ah, here, right at the back of the book. Not a good sign. Of course. Blah, blah. Forging magic swords so is very it. difficult. Yes, yes. The high art of smithing. Only level 98 smiths <laughs> can forge magic swords. <laughs> Great. That's not very good at all. Roughly calculated, my level is zero. Let's see. Okay. This is where they explain how a magic sword can be repaired. You have, you have to, to reforge it, it and then uh -huh. hold it in dragon fire. And what am I going to practice on until I'm at level 98? That doesn't sound bad. Copper, copper pots. pots. Pretty simple, and you only need one raw material. Copper. <laughs> ah, great. Back to the, to the volcano. Put the copper on the anvil. No? Let's see. Maybe we should... Uh, oh no, sorry. This goes here. I'll put in as many stones as possible. This goes... Uh, deep into the furnace. Even with the pliers, the heat's almost unbearable. Take it out. The copper's melted and run out of the stones. I wouldn't have thought there would be so much. Mm -hmm. That's good. With that, probably you have to use it somewhere on the anvil. The copper's too runny. I can't work it like that. Okay. So, here? All right. Just a piece of copper. Now we can work it, I hope. The copper is still hot, but it'll slowly harden. Let's give it a go then. We put it here. Some smithy work. And later we get what? Not perfect just yet, but then I'm only a level one blacksmith. Only another 97 pots. Oh, for the love of God. What's up? Get the copper, smelt the copper, make the pot. We have to get the most out of our playtime, so let's get going. Will he actually do it? <sighs> well, okay, I'll do it on my own. <laughs> Are you arguing with me, Nate? Because if you do, much later, very much later, <laughs> 98 pots, level 98. Wow, that was fun. Very repetitive, well, I believe. I can now forge pretty much anything, including broken magic swords. But we still need, uh, according to the book, we need dragon fire for that. <laughs> ah, good. Speaking as a level 98 blacksmith, I know what needs to be done. <laughs> Ta-da! I've reforged the sword that was once broken. Now I've just got to harden it in some dragon fire. Hmm. The sword has been repaired, but as it is, it's just an everyday sword. Cool. Oh. Now. <laughs> Copper pots. Copper pots. 98 of them, and each one nicer than the other. <laughs> Great. Just I just can't us? understand why some people don't enjoy doing the same thing 98 times. It's very calming. Is it? You! I need your dragon fire. Oh, gorgeous. Yes? <sighs> True. Let's finish the this. The sword needs to be tempered in dragon fire. Would you do the honors? Oh, that that isn't going to be easy. I've never breathed fire before. Hmm. And here's me thinking you're a dragon. I am. But in order <laughs> to spew fire, one has to be mad with anger. That is the normal state of mind for most dragons, is it not? So we have to anger you somehow. But I don't, I, I don't really do anger. I did a lot of autogenic training and yoga in the past. No, that's just beautiful. Hmm. So we have to try to provoke her. Do you know that you're pretty damned ugly, even for a dragon? You mean... Monstrously ugly and terrifying. Oh, come on! Thank you! <sighs> Stupid. Your football team's not up to much. Let's Your football team stinks! They can't play, they'll never be able to play, and every fan they have is an idiot! What is football? It's oh, when you on. Uh, have a ball and. Ah, oh, forget it. <laughs> That's the only one we can use You're left. really, really dumb. 
Why do you say that? Well, because it's a fact. But it isn't true. I've always been an avid reader. Didn't do much for you. I've never met such a thick old dragon before. Not that I've hey, met very dragons. That's not very much very dragons. Nice. The number but is probably one. One thing should be obvious to you at least. That is. <sighs> dragons like you shouldn't go training. Yeah. I reckon dragons like you just shouldn't pursue a monster education. Why ever not? You don't belong in the world of work. You should go find yourself <laughs> a terror-inducing husband who has a good job and can look after you. That is... The main thing is, though... <sighs> you will never be a dangerous monster, Let true. Let me give it to you straight. You will never become a dangerous monster. <laughs> Your dreams? Forget them. You really think so? I... I do sometimes think that, too. No! But I... I would so love to... <laughs> oh, I don't want to break her heart. No, this is not anger. This is sadness. Oh, for Pete's sake, who do you want to be, then? <laughs> Come on. Oh, come Another on. woman is Yoga just. masters don't feel pain. It'll pass. You will become a real evil monster just like all the others. <laughs> Do you really think so? Yes. Of course. Oh, thank you. This conversation so much. is so. Um. <sighs> yes, fire spitting, that's what we need. What I've been trying to tell you the whole time is. Yes. Ah. <sighs> Stupid. You're really, really dumb. Try Why again this. Say that? Because it but it is didn't do much. Hey. But uh, one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm making one? fun of your lifestyle and value system here. Is, um, is that good or bad? Well, bad. I'm contradicting all of your opinions. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, forget it. Come on. Hmm. This one? Your mother found you so obnoxious she gave you away. <laughs> of course. That's what dragons do. Have you ever oh. had anything to do with dragon children? You definitely do not want those around. Four well, of points. course. Burning, poisonous, oozing excrement. Mm hmm. Oh, it has to be this I one. reckon dragons like you just shouldn't pursue a monster education. You don't. But that yes, is the main. We heard that. <laughs> you stink. You stink like hell. My eyes are stinging. Yes, my sulfur odor probably has that effect <laughs> on you humans. Male dragons, however, have always found it most agreeable. But my I'm not a male dragon. Boyfriend even called me. His little stinky poo. Uh, oh, come on. May I perhaps offer you a little tea and... Uh-uh. <sighs> what a... Yes. Where this leads, I need to provoke her somehow. You're really Why do you... Because it's a fa But it isn't true. I didn't do much for you. I've never... Hey. Yes, that's the one. But one thing... I'm making fun of your life, I... I reckon one. dragons like you just shouldn't... Why ever not? You don't belong in the world. That is... The main... Uh... But you could help me out, sweetheart. My shirt could use a wash and an iron. <laughs> Will this help? Yes. I, I breathed fire! Good for both of us. I and... was so angry that I... Thank yes! You. My pleasure. I did it! Hello? Sword? Ah! Hot! What the hell are you doing? <sighs> Bathing you I in a dragon fire? You after you got accidentally snapped by a dragon. Yeah. Where is that monster? I wanna bathe in her blood! <laughs> we, we don't have time for that now. We still have a pretty big task to do. I'll slash you away through our enemies. <sighs> Here we are. Nate became a warrior. Oh, Vladdy, <laughs> not more fighting. <laughs> I recognize your spineless blabbering. And I recognize your brainless aggression. Oh, great. 
that smart ass is here too. Everyone now, quiet, back, please. Let's get with the program. Oh, let's that's what split we have to scouts. Do. Yeah. Great. Oh, a barbaric no. sword, a pacifistic shield, let's go swimming. and Come a hypocritical on, day. helmet. Shut your trap, and that goes for all of you. Now that we're all together, you guys are going to get <laughs> me into the orc camp. Yeah! No! No! <laughs> so I can get my friend out of there. <sighs> A Great. rescue mission? We'll have to proceed very carefully and diplomatically. As I said. I think you should spit in the face of the biggest orc in the camp. I don't think I deserve this. But that's the only thing we can do! Why do I need... Why do I have a feather yet? I have no idea. Speak with the dragon, maybe she... The good lady has better things to do than help me. I think so. Let's get out of here. To the crypt. Safe here. And that will be for today. We finally move forward with this big event. We have the shield, we have the sword, we have the helmet, we have the armor, we look like a warrior, and this time we'll kick some orcish ass, I hope. Thank you very much for listening, my name is Gabriel, and of course, this is The Book of Unwritten Tales, and it's a let's play. Have a nice day.